there won't be no dancing when the truth comes out filling up the rooms downstairs hello welcome back to city nights i'm here with uh, homer's oh that's right he's over there ready to interview homer Shadowheart is ready to interview the jimmy d3 right over here homer take it away thank you josh I've heard that before. I'm here with Jimmy, the Jimmy D3. Um, if you would introduce the band for us, Jimmy. Um, directly to that side of you is Debbie from Rochester, our drummer, and then Matt from the Mortals, the bass player, and I'm, I'm Jimmy D. Kind of was left. That, was you know, that made sense, right? Yeah, right. I'm the last one, so I, I must be me. So, I was told that I have to ask you guys how you met, how you formed. Well. The story of how this began was Matt and I were out in your parking lot because he was in another band and we were having a conversation about all those songs that you write in bands that then break up that you never play again. And I was like, yeah, I wrote some good songs when I was skinny. So then, uh, so back in the spring, he goes, hey, uh, you, are you serious about that? Let's play those old songs. Me. So, this is me. All right. Yeah, here. Yes. Yeah. Face camera. Face you look at the camera, camera too. You look at the camera. Switch hands. There, there we go. go. Okay. Go. So Matt and I just said, yeah, okay, we'll play. And then uh, two weeks later, he calls me and goes, hey, Debbie's in. And I'm like, okay. And then, um, and then the, um, the lovely folks at uh, JBM Productions, uh, John and Brenda, actually hired us to open for Big Sandy and the Fly Right Boys. Yeah. So we had to uh, uh, finish writing uh, nine songs so we'd be able to play for half an hour. And um, nobody threw anything at us. Uh, nobody asked for their money back. So we said, okay, we'll stick with this. And now we're uh, uh, currently in uh, finishing up pre-production on our EP, which hopefully, hopefully we'll have out this fall. Cool. And, um, and then we've, we've almost got the artwork for our T-shirt finished. Very cool. A T-shirt and an EP coming out. Yeah. The T-shirt's probably more important. Nobody well, actually buys EPs anymore, so it, it'll be, it'll be. We'll, we can actually sell T-shirts to people. Music you have to give away now. Yeah, trust me. My new car doesn't have a CD player. I'm really upset about that. Uh, exactly. So you, you actually met in our parking lot. So oh, yeah. musicians, if you want to come and meet in the parking lot, you can form a great band. That's what they're saying, I think. Well, we didn't meet there. Uh, I've known him for uh, 35 years. Uh, He's been in uh, several bands, and uh, I, I, produced a, I produced a record for him that got his band, The Mortal, signed to uh, one of those big Seattle labels. They were uh, part of the Seattle sound back in the good days. And then I rode in a van with them, you know, uh, five guys in a van that smelled bad, and, and we drove around the country twice, and then the next thing I knew, uh, uh, Matt quit. <laughs> so, so Matt, is that remnants of flannel you're wearing? It's is, somewhere underneath here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. Just and Doc Martens, of course. It's, so. It's to look that way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know these guys, Debbie? Oh yeah. Um, we're actually neighbors. Okay. Uh, we played in a band together before, and Jim. I played with Jim and um, with Maurice Matai. Um, so yeah, we played played a little bit here and there. Mm -hmm. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah. Nice to get to know you guys. Uh, you ready to play some more for us? Well, we th the one thing we didn't mention is that the original plan for this band was we got together to be a, uh, a Carpenter's tribute band, which is why we had to, yeah. you know, we had, that, that makes we sense. Yeah. That makes sense. Don't work on my weight right now. Okay. Well, don't work on it too hard. Remember what it did to Karen. Right. Um, <laughs> so, everything Karen lost, so. I found. So. <laughs> Jimmy made up for it. <laughs> it doesn't go to waste. It's, all good jokes, all, all good jokes. Uh, I don't remember her brother's name, but we're just kidding. Uh, Richard. <laughs> Richard, Richard Carpenter. Um, you guys ready to hear some more Jimmy D3? Yeah. Give it up. Yeah. I first saw you scared and lonely eyes that shine in the blackest night you said stranger things have happened i felt the fire from those lies that cut and burn gone too far gone too long i have to say Thank 
thousand miles of endless highway. You turn it up just to tear it down. You take that river and run it slowly. You count the hours just waiting on. wearing away November nights are cold and forgotten you take your number past one to see it all far before it begins it's just a mile a minute it's just a ride great very good yeah thank homer thank you so much for coming and hosting again thank you for asking me so i hope next marriage you can keep be back on you i'm know, sure that like you'll <laughs> help me in that one um. <laughs> this is not my fault i did not know why i invited you to host so i just want you to know when you talk to lawyers i was not involved right so. right anyway right anyway expect a call so uh one thing on the show we always do is everyone cnightstv.com go to the website Watch shows. Find out who's coming here. Other things. Make up something that's on the site. Other uh, people's names. Their people's names. Their yeah, phone addresses. Numbers. It's like Facebook, but numbers. only yeah. without all the ads. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You know, it's really great, Homer. It, it's great having someone to host with me that doesn't have anything to plug. That Scott's always talking about black and bluegrass roller growth. It's just great. Thank you, Homer, for being on. And you have nothing to plug at all. It well, is, I mean, what? Th there is a what? show coming up a, a comedy show oh yeah um, we're gonna be doing I guess you're involved I, I will be involved actually course, it's uh course. it's a benefit we don't have a date it'll be in September though uh -huh. at the American Sign Museum okay. uh, it's actually you're just making the stuff up I'm not you. I'm not okay. it's raising money and mm -hmm. and coats for the reservations oh. in Oklahoma Okay, so it's for a good cause. It's for a good cause. Okay, yes, yes. okay, you're allowed to promote that. Yes. So, but that's in September at the American Sign Museum. Yes, yes. You can check uh, my Facebook page, which is just Homer Shadowheart. Not just Homer Shadowheart, just Homer Shadowheart. Um, <laughs> yes. Some people are weird. I don't know. That's true. There's millions of fans going to just Homer Shadowheart <laughs> right now. 
<laughs> totally lost. Millions of people watch this. Yeah. So how's it feel hosting again? It feels good. It feels yeah? good, yeah. feel like we haven't lost a thing, which is sad. Oh, um, well, I think you're going to lose something very soon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but let's gain some more music. Yes. What do you think? Music is good for the soul. You want to introduce them? Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the Jimmy D3. Just because I can Just a little. 
living because I can. Stand. 